Son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have eternal life. 2,000 years ago, there was a man called Jesus Christ. He came to earth from God, by God, as the Son of God. He came to this earth and lived a life for you and for me, teaching us how to live. He died for you and for me, that we might not die to our sins, but that we may live in Him, for Him, with Him, for eternity. Jesus Christ is calling you to come to Him today. He said, come to me, all you who are weary and burned, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me. I am simple and humble of heart, and you will find rest for your souls, for my yoke is easy and my burden is light. Jesus Christ came to earth 2,000 years ago to pay the penalty for your sins, for your mistakes, and for mine, for all who have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. All men and women have sinned on them because of the ways that they have hurt themselves, others, and ultimately God. And for that reason, God sent His Son, Jesus Christ, to earth 2,000 years ago to pay the penalty for your sin and for mine. He died on a cross. He was crucified. His skin was ripped off His back. He was whipped. He's had a crown of thorns placed on His head. He was spat on. He was mocked. For you and for me, He knows the number of hairs on your head. He sees your tears. He hears your cries. And He is calling you today to come to Him. Come to Jesus Christ. Accept the price that He paid for your sin and for mine. Open your ears to hear the word of the Lord. Open your ears and hearts to receive Him. To receive the truth. The truth that Jesus Christ gave up His life for you. No one is perfect. All have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. Every single person, man, woman and child has made mistakes that have hurt others, themselves and ultimately God. And for that reason, all need Jesus Christ. Without Christ, there is no life, there is only death. Without Christ, there is no hope, there is only hopelessness and despair. Without Christ, there is only futile dreams that come and go. As the rain comes and goes, so do they. For without Christ there is no hope. For in this hope we were saved. But hope that is seen is no hope at all. Who hopes for what he already has? But if we hope for what we do not yet have, we wait for it patiently. Jesus Christ sees your tears. He hears the cries of your heart. He's listening to your prayers. Will you now listen to his voice? Will you now open up your ears and heart to receive his word? Stop turning your back on the Lord Jesus Christ who gave up his life for you. Before you were in your mother's womb, he knew you by name. And for that reason, he gave up his life for you that you may have the opportunity to come to Jesus Christ to repent of your sins through the sacrifice that he has made of his very life for you and for me. Come to me, all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me. For I am gentle and humble of heart, and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy, and my burden is light. Come now to Jesus Christ. Now come.